Oh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Good morning, in fact. Just good morning, good morning, good morning. And welcome to Star Sector. I have gotten out of bed particularly early today to come and make a video. Despite the fact that this is now the um, easily the third video I've made today. Um, and none of it went very well. I just... I couldn't really express what I was trying to say. Um, so I gave up on all of it. The general crux of what I was saying was I've been away. I haven't been making videos. I've just been busy. I've been super, super busy. Um, just as a, uh, a point of information, the date is the 1st of April 2020. We are in the midst of a overwhelming global pandemic and uh yeah life's a little bit weird at the moment um life's a bit weird everything's a little bit difficult to deal with so um yeah making videos hasn't been high priority at the moment I just, mainly because I haven't had, I have not, just not had time at all. I've been managing a team. I've literally just started a, started a brand new job um, less than a month ago um, as a retail manager and uh, what, within 24 hours of getting in the store? global pandemic hits and um, yeah that's a crisis so it's been a difficult time haven't really spent a lot of time with my family um, haven't had a lot of time on my computer when I'm not at work making videos just hasn't been a possibility at all and it's been a massive shame because I find uh, making videos to be quite a good Catharsis, let's say that. There is a good way of me relieving any stresses that I've got in the day, and I just haven't been able to do that at the moment. So I thought I'd come back and just explain where I've been and uh, get back into Star Sector because it's been so long. Um, and I miss it, and I miss making these videos, and I miss talking to people. I'm just doing a mission, apparently. So we've gone into Garnia uh, Extraction Depot and we have met with some pirates and they've given us information about where a red planet is um okay that's where we're at at the moment let's go back in there without our transponder on and grab some stuff we'll come back to that and we've got dropped off any goods that we don't need to be carrying with us let's have a look um, like I said, I already made a bunch of videos. Um, one of them was I started doing a mission here in Star Sector and I found myself talking about what's going on in life, etc. And it was really depressing and it was quite self-obsessed uh, self and it, it wasn't a good look for a video. So... I fucked off and uh, now we're back and we will I don't, actually don't know if I want to take that one um, we'll leave that one we'll take that one basically the red planet we want to travel to is a shit ton of miles away uh, light years away 477 fuel we need to get there we didn't have the capacity for it we've picked up this ship we should have the capacity for it we'll go from there so uh, we now have the capacity for 1100 fuel. Hopefully that will ch that that will get us where we need to be. We have a almost full quota of uh, crewmen, able seamen, if you will, to help travel that distance. So we just need to get about another uh, 700 fuel from somewhere. So hopefully we can pick some up from Garnier the pirate base where we previously went so yeah a, a much shorter version of what i said in the previous video is been a, i've been working a lot 
I've been quite stressed. I've not had a lot of time with my family. Uh, it's um, it's been difficult, as it has been for everybody. Um, it was already hard enough trying to learn a new job, uh, and then you add global pandemic to the mix, and um, it was a lot to take on on top of what was already going on. So there you go. That's where we're at. We won't dwell on any dwell on it any further. Why are there fees to pay on that? <clears throat> That's unusual. Um, how are we crewed? Have we got enough crew? Uh, 575 skeleton crew. Done. Sorted. No problem. Right. So uh, what else can we take? We've... Got all the fuel that's available there. Now we need to go and get fuel from somewhere else. So where else can we get fuel from? Jangler. Hello, Jangler. One of our old haunts. I have no idea. Uh, I didn't get as far as uh, actually going to the red uh, planet that we were previously discussing. <laughs> oh, hang on. Let's grab that fuel there. And then we're good to go, I think. What have we got in the, the way of ships that we can take? Can we have any of your ships? No, because we need a commission, which we don't have. I don't want any of the black market ones. And I don't want any of those, really. So, yeah. Let's, let's just go out and... Uh, ah, we got plenty of fuel now. Travel to cash, I guess. Find this red planet. The goal for the upcoming weeks, I guess, then, is um, I need to settle into my job a little better. I'm having I mean, issues within that itself. Like it was already, like I said, it was already difficult learning a new job and learning, meeting new people, um, trying to be somebody's employer whilst also uh, learning a job. And then you add... Uh, global pandemic to the mix <clears throat> um, it's been an experience that's for sure <laughs> granted no greater or uh, no worse than a lot of people's experience um, but you know I can only talk about my personal experience um, I'm in a very lucky position in that I'm able to keep working so uh, I'm not going to complain too much So going forward, though, uh, now having a a much better income than I previously did, um, I'll, I'll I'll be honest with you, I've never been so glad that I'd uh, stopped being self-employed. Um, so having a much better income than I did previously uh, going forward, it means we're going to be. I've already set up my direct debits for my new internet so we'll be having a much faster upload speed which means i can put out much more um, a lot more videos in a shorter period of time because one of the big barriers to me uploading videos was uh, i was making four or five videos in a single day and then it would take me three or four days to just upload them because my internet was so fucking shit <laughs> So uh, hopefully, you know, um, 17th of April. So from here, that's that's just over two weeks away from me. Um, we'll be having uh, the top package that uh, Virgin Media would allow me to have. No advertisements in here. I have no particular affiliation with any uh, internet service providers. I just, uh, they were the only ones that were willing to offer me what I needed. I'm going to hit a soft save here, actually. Just um, oh, soft save, a save copy. just in case something goes uh, hideously wrong, which I'm fully anticipating happening. I imagine we're going to be met by a enormous amount of uh, pirates as we approach this planet. So we're going to go dark on our approach. Yeah, so the plan is then on days off to just create as many videos as I can in a short period of time and, uh, and then upload them all in a very short period of time, set some uh, a bit of an upload schedule 
and then hopefully get down to maybe having uh, one or two streams a week over on the Twitch channel, uh, which is twitch.tv forward slash arsenic underscore candy. And you should definitely go and check us out over there. I um, mean, we haven't streamed for a while, but we will be pretty soon. There are some automated defenses. Um, fuck. A radiant class standard drone battleship. Brilliant class standard drone ship cruiser. A fulgent class support drone ship. Let's do it. Fuck it. What? Um, no guts, no glory. It doesn't mean that I'm going to uh, be entirely happy with the outcome. But there you go. It is what it is. We'll just do it a bit at a time and see what we can get out of this. I think what we're actually going to get out of this is utterly fucking obliterated. So where's our flagship? I can't even remember what our flagship is. It's that one there. I actually don't even remember what the controls are. No. Well, this is <laughs> over pretty quickly. So let's take this dude out as, as quickly as we can. Now imagine this is going to have a pretty shitty ending. Well, that's one of our ships already disabled. Oh my. Oh my. Well, it, it looks like this could be the end of the road. For Captain Ace Frontier. 11 minutes into a video that I intended to be about 30 to 45 minutes. That is not what I expected to happen there. But there you go. That's what happens. Um, that's an entire fleet obliterated in about 30 seconds. So there's another ship gone. I'm sorry boys for doing this to you. Can we take over one of these ships? Oh, there you go. We just came out of... Oh, we did transfer command. I don't think we're going to last over. Yeah, that was a mistake. Well, the adventures of Ace Frontier have been very uh, fun up to this point, but I think they're over today. I think that is the end of the road, Captain Ace Frontier. Not to say that we won't have some sort of uh, alternate universe where Captain Ace Frontier comes back, but for now that adventure is over. It's been a journey, and I think that's probably the best we can say for it, is that it's been a journey it's been backwards and forwards across a massive sector of space. Achieving almost nothing on our own. But I've had fun. I hope you have fun too. I think that might be it. Is that everybody gone? That's all of our ships gone. So let's. Oh, we can't even can't even just leave the battle. Where's 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 the rest of our ships then? Are they all gone? Order a full retreat. Leave. We've just <laughs> oh, AC fucking moron. Well, young man, it's been a pleasure. Thank you for your uh, service. And guys, thank you for tuning in. It's a short video. It's not how I expected it to end. Maybe it isn't the end. Maybe it isn't the end for Ace Frontier. Who knows? But we won't find out for... Uh, for today at least thanks for joining me it's been my absolute pleasure to entertain you for a period of time i hope 
that we return to being entertained for a future period of time. I'll catch you really soon. You take care. Thanks very much. Cheerio. Bye-bye.